hello everyone in this video i will going to discuss how you can update r in my previous video i have already mentioned how you can download r and install in windows however the uh, r version you are using and ins and uh, already installed maybe the latest version for this instance However, after uh, uh, three to six or maybe one year later, new version uh, may be released by the contributor. Then you need to update your R package. However, uh, one thing uh, you can ask me that why we uh, why we need to update R. Uh, because we have already uh, certain we are using certain version and some package uh, with the uh, you the packages you are uh, you are working with it's working fine but uh, if you're using a, a very well older version of R the packages that uh, comes new or get uh, the packages itself also updated might not be compatible with the older version of R for that reason, you need to update R. Uh, uh, not frequently, but uh, at least after uh, three to six months. Okay, so uh, the first question is that how you will know that which version of R you are using. So for that, you can uh, just type session uh, info and then you can hit enter. You will be able to see the version of uh, the R you are using currently. Uh, my version of the R of R is 4.1.3, which is uh, which is a recent version uh, in the month of April 2022. Um, but uh, what if you don't have the latest version? For that, you need a package called install R. Install R. This package you need. So I will uh, ship to the uh, uh, not. I will do this not in the R Studio. So I will type uh, here the uh, install R as you can see. If you don't have this package, you can of course uh, down uh, install it by just typing install dot packages and then within the first bracket and within the inverted comma you have to type install r and then you can hit enter since i have already uh, i have already uh, in uh, this package in my console so i will just do library install r okay so then you need to uh, just type update and capital r then the first bracket and then you need to hit enter so if you have a uh, you know the older version if you if you do not have the latest version of r then a message will pop up here uh, like this uh, no sorry this one uh, yeah this uh, this type of message will pop up here that you are using uh, the current version which is whatever version you have will be written here and the latest version available will be written here now you have to uh, choose the option ok to install the newest version so once you will um, uh, uh, yeah, click on ok it will automatically update your uh, you know the pack uh, the R. Uh, you don't have to do anything however um, uh, there will be some uh, some type, uh, message that uh, do you want to install the latest version of R? you just need to click it yes uh, then uh, 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 some message will also come that whether you need to copy all the packages you are using in the older version of R to the newest version of the R just you have to uh, click on yes 
you need to read whatever is written on the uh, pop-up message and accordingly you have to follow and you need to uh, you know uh, click on OK or yes after that once it is done you will see a, a message that your uh, R in the Windows version has already uh, its setup is finished and uh, then uh, you will you can close uh, this and you can uh, if you are working in R studio you need to uh, close the R studio uh, where you are you were working previously then uh, you will again open the uh, R studio and you have to check whether you, uh, the news version uh, has updated successfully or not you need to do again session info and you will be able to see uh, the recent version of R that uh, is uh, that you that uh, was showing in the, that pop of mes message uh, another thing I just forgot to tell you that when you will uh, install the uh, installer R uh, by typing uh, install.package and then install R, there will be an option uh, like this. Mm -hmm. Yeah like this you will uh, you will be able to see, uh, see an option where you secure cran mirrors from this you have to select any one of the crans i usually select usa i and http uh, it doesn't matter much you can select any of uh, any of them but i usually uh, select us uh, i a https so uh, um likewise you can uh, update your r package and uh, you you can then uh, use it very uh, you know smoothly with your latest version another thing is that uh, in r studio also uh, in tools package you can uh, see the updates for r studio also for that you can click on tools then check uh, check for packages update <clears throat> okay this is for package updates the package you already have in the R is uh, it will be shown here if it is completely updated then uh, a message will show that uh, all you know all uh, packages are updated otherwise there will be a uh, name of those packages and then you have to uh, check on the uh, packages you want to update it and then you need to click on install update i think i have some issues with my internet connection that's why it's taking so much of time um, i will just i'll just close it it, it will taking forever um, also what i wanted to show you that yeah uh, check uh, you can also check for the updates of our studio by clicking check for updates here also if you have the latest version of uh, our studio then it will show that you are using the latest version of our studio otherwise the version that um, um, you know uh, the, that is available for the update will be shown here you just need to uh, install it from the uh, you know website uh, the, the same website I have already uh, showed you previously uh, that uh, from our studio download for Windows from uh, here you can uh, download the R Studio, uh, recent version of R Studio, and the and it uh, you can install it just like uh, yeah uh, you you have to download it from here and then it will uh, download in your you know laptop or computer wherever you are working in. Then you have to just uh, click uh, just you have to install like normal software that you are using. So uh, uh, I think uh, yeah since i already told you that i have some issues with my internet connection so nothing happening 
today. Anyways, uh, I have already told you the procedure for installing R and uh, R Studio uh, um, and also how to update it. Uh, however, if you have any queries regarding the updates uh, of R and R Studio, you can uh, mail me and uh, I will be happy to, uh, you know, answer your queries. Uh, however, for this video, I think uh, that's it for this video. Thank you for watching.